I just think it's one where Newcastle United, this is an opportunity to actually test the resolve of Everton. And if you look at the league table, the top, but if you also look at the goals against column, I think they've only conceded one less than Newcastle. And we all saw what happened when Southampton um, you know, had the audacity to have a go at Carlo Ancelotti's men, you know, down on the south coast last week, picked up a 2 0 win and created lots of chances and were able to stay on the front foot with Everton unable to respond. And yeah, they did have the red card, uh, which was a very unfortunate one. Um, but for Newcastle, you know, they cannot keep playing like they are without, you know, being in a real situation where they could lose. I mean, at Wolves last week, um, it was a good point in the end and now the dust settled you know we can we can say you know they were lucky at the end of the day because while they were only 1-0 down they conceded a lot of chances and had Wolves you know had the shooting boots on as I said on Sunday then you know that game would have been finished by half time so it's about them not putting themselves in that position about them um, you know trying to you know build early in the game and if they do manage to get that early goal like they did against Man United it's known what to do in that situation and you know rather than just retreat retreat um, they need to to push on and try and just give themselves a situation where the game's you know dead you know be a couple of goals up be two or three up and um, you know then then you can you know make life difficult for the opposition but really I think Steve Bruce knows that uh, a convincing performance is required against Everton uh, because patience, I think, in the fan base, despite the points tally so far, it is wearing a little bit thin in terms of style of play. So hopefully we see that pick up this weekend.